Hey, I'm going to talk about one of my other little hobbies for just a little bit here. This is a longer Ray 5 20 watt engraving laser. Uh, this is something that I use for a lot of little household projects and to, uh, you know, do a little side hustle stuff. And one of the things that I did with this laser was uh, from the factory, it's got a great big old fan on top of the laser module. And it has this grill. And the volume, I know it's not really gonna shine through on the phone, uh, but the biggest thing I, I didn't like about this was, I, this is in my garage. Uh, basically outside, things get really dusty and dirty and uh, there's no way to attach a filter. I wanted to attach a filter. So I made this thing here. This gives me a great big old fat barrel that lets me attach a filter. And uh, these are, you know, legitimate airfoils inside, but they were made so that I could, uh, you know, have some rigidity to the thing, and uh, it lets me print this with pretty thin walls. Now, someone on uh, one of one of the laser groups on Facebook, he modified the top of his laser uh, with some spacers to reduce noise. Reducing noise didn't even cross my mind, uh, and this kind of started me on a little bit of a project. And we can see there's a rattle is because the fan's not bolted down. Kind of have to ignore the rattle. But you can hear the, the sound. And it legitimately does make it sound much... Uh, much quieter, it's much more muted. And like I said, I made this specifically to where I could put a, a filter on it. But uh, after seeing that it uh, does help with the sound, I kind of started to play with things and I made this one. This one has much thinner airfoils. I can't remember exactly what the airfoils are, but they're modified a little bit anyway, so it no longer matters. And they got a nice curve going on inside. One of the things I like, you can't, you can't accidentally put your finger in there. We're gonna go listen to the three of them. We got this one. Which is much more muted. The fan does not slow down at all. This one has almost none of that wine shining through, but there's more of a white noise sound behind it. That's what it sounds like with the filter on. I'm trying to do this one-handed, which is not very good. And that filter keeps the inside of the laser real clean or much cleaner. Anyway, let's try it with this one. Just so we can get a little sound clip of all three or both of these. Huh. Wow. Nice. I just wanted to show what that sounded like. Both of these, I will have a link for other Ray 5 users. I'll have a link to these in the description below. 
if you've got your own printer and you have this 20 watt module for your Ray 5, you can print these out for free. You can have those. Uh, I also will sell these through my eBay store. If, uh, if you happen to want one, there will be a link for that also. Uh, yeah. So anyway, another hobby of mine. Thought I'd share. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a wonderful evening.